Hello viewers, I am Kirti Bhave. Welcome to the session on metal cladding. After going through this video, you will be able to state the objectives of metal cladding, explain the process of metal cladding and enumerate the applications of metal cladding. Let us begin with the definition. To clad means to cover. When one metallic surface is covered with another, it is cladding. But technically, it can be defined as a type of protective coating where the protective material such as metal foil is bonded to a substrate by applying heat or pressure. Why would you clad a metal? Give it a thought. Metallic surfaces are coated with adherent coatings of other metals to protect against corrosion, sometimes to alter specific functional properties such as wear resistance and electrical conductivity, etc. And most of the times, to combine the properties of two metals. What is the principle of metal cladding? Metal cladding involves bonding firmly and permanently a dense homogeneous layer of coating metal to the base metal on one or both sides. The thickness of the cladding metal ranges from 5% to 20% of the composite plate. And the choice of cladding metal depends upon the specific property that has to be developed or enhanced. Let us see the process of metal cladding. This is a schematic representation of metal cladding process. Here you have the base metal which is literally sandwiched between two thin sheets of coating material. It is then passed through hot rollers and because of the action of heat and pressure, the sheets stick to each other and thus you have the base metal which is cladded by the coating metal. There is another way by which we can carry out metal cladding. Here an ingot is casted with base metal inside and coating metal on the outside. This ingot then is rolled into sheet and you will have a sheet of the base metal which is cladded with the coating metal or it is drawn into wire and the core of the wire will be of base metal while the covering will be of the cladding metal. Let us see the applications of metal cladding. Metal cladding is widely used to develop surface properties like corrosion resistance in steel. And most often it is used to produce combining advantage of two metals. For example, copper cladded steel wire has strength due to steel and electrical conductivity due to copper, 
which cannot be obtained by alloying copper and steel. Similarly, L-clad sheets are produced which are aluminium sheets cladded on duralumin sheets. These have strength of duralumin and lightness of aluminium. Let us revise the key concepts. Metal cladding is a process of fusing two dissimilar metals to improve surface properties, to combine properties of two metals. But the disadvantage is that only plain surfaces can be protected by metal cladding. Uneven surfaces cannot be metal cladded. I hope you have understood the concept of metal cladding. Thank you.